here's a little tip on the tweak edit brush in ZBrush it's basically uh, just lets you pull on the mesh as you can see I got limitations how far I can pull if I pull way up past the canvas it just stops right there control Z that and what we're going to use is uh, deformation size but before we do that you'll notice we got some sub tools here and if I resize the head the eyes are going to st uh, stay the same size so I'm going to make this uh, one mesh here in a minute I'm going to set the geometry back down to two here I'm going to use this little plug-in by Game Master and make it one mesh as you can see we have no sub tools a uh, good tip is do not divide the mesh until you resize it so we're going to set the size to minus 99 and the XYZ axes as you can see it got quite small as you can see it's indicating uh, there's something on the canvas here but you almost cannot see it so what I need to do is click one time on the canvas here not on the mesh and hit the period key to resize it then we'll go ahead and divide it three times now let's see what the tweak edit brush can do to it always pull at the lowest subdivision level as you can see you can pull quite far. I could actually pull off the canvas if I wanted to. Now this might not work very well in uh, exporting this to other applications, but this is not tutorial about that. You might have to resize it again. And I'll set the subdivision back up to three. Kind of preview it. Anytime that we edit something, we'll go ahead and set it back down to one. And we'll tweak the air a little bit. And we'll set the slider back up. We'll control Z that a couple times. And the bigger that you put your draw size, the more volume you can grab to tweak it. So I'll grab towards the back of the head here. As you can see, you can get quite far on it. We'll set it back up to three. But anyway, this is a little tip on the tweak edit brush. Thank you very much.